the final stop of our 2020 Colorado hiking adventure after the Lost Lake hike led us to a lakeside campground right next to Mount Albert, Colorado's tallest mountain. About 15 minutes south of Leadville are the Twin Lakes, two natural glacial lakes nestled under the shadows of Colorado's tallest mountains that have been enlarged for water storage, now covering 2,700 surface acres. There are miles of shoreline to explore. We decided to take it easy on our last day and stay around the area to check out the lakes up close and personal. How far can you go? Dude, if I fall, my I'm done. No more. <laughs> Action to the limit. Tied to the limit. <laughs> Tied. Twin Lakes is one of the best places in Colorado for outdoor aquatic activities. Its deep water is stocked every year with brown, rainbow, and cutthroat trout, which makes for excellent fishing. Lake trout average 19 inches, with trophy sizes of 40 plus inches becoming more and more abundant. And in the winter, when the lake freezes over, Twin Lakes becomes one of Leadville's most popular ice fishing destinations. It's also where Leadville's Rod and Gun Club hosts its annual Twin Lakes Ice Fishing Derby. Lots of people enjoy canoeing, kayaking, paddle boarding, and boating as well, with a boat ramp on both the east and west sides, making it easily accessible. Or you can just do what we did, and find a nice campsite, then take a relaxing stroll around the area. We stumbled upon a nice campground called White Star Campground, and we were so impressed at how nice it was that we ended up running to the store to get some steaks to grill and stayed another night. From camp, we had views of the surrounding mountains, and because it's located right next to Twin Lakes, we were able to get to it super easy. There's so much to do in this area. Also, the Continental Divide Trail passes right by this campground, so we thought that was pretty cool. Because we had more than three tents, we were required to get a second site, but we were able to get two right next to each other, with clean restrooms and a large drinking water barrel in between. After we watched the sunset, 
we sat back and ended our journey by enjoying a spectacular view of the moon and stars overhead.